Uh, I guess I could work on other rooms. What will this room be? First of all, what, what will the floor be? Because if I'm making another bedroom, I probably make the floor wool again. See, like, it's so much easier to plan things out once you have all the materials you need for it, so. I think I'll hold off. I've got a bedroom. I guess I could. I guess I could go and get some signs, and that'll make it a little easier. If I grab my signs, I can. And, uh. Keep track of what my plans are. I have like a sitting. I, could, I guess I could have even a sitting room in here. Or di oh, dining room. That's a good idea. Dining room. There we go. Okay. And then in this one, what do you want next to a dining room? Uh, I think maybe a bathroom. Bathroom. That'll work. Okay. So. I guess for a bathroom, you wouldn't want carpet floors, that's for sure, so this one I'll have to use be a stone. I guess I could do the same checkered pattern. Checkered pattern or solid floor. Uh, checkered. There we go. And I put all my slabs in the other room, so I'll have to come back for that. Okay. I don't really have enough iron for this, but I could probably go, I might move this around a bit, toilet, uh, I guess that could be a toilet, if you use your imagination, maybe the one higher, it's more like a bathroom scale, I don't know, <laughs> doesn't look like anything really. Um, let's see. If I had more iron, I'd make like a bathtub here. Maybe like a... One could be a sink. And bathtub. Somewhere like... Okay, I wouldn't put it here. There we go. I'd make it more like... Well, when I have more iron, I'll sort this out later. Okay, so... Those rooms are planned out. That's good. And any other rooms that I can't really think of a purpose for, I'll just, like, kind of... I'll put the uh, wool... The wool on a cloth. I'll put the wool walls around the room, and I'll put, like, maybe some... Uh, some wooden like, flooring down or something. And then I'll just leave it like that. Kind of just... Kind of just for the sake of having a mansion, just to have a cool base. Considering an inf dev, there's not too much you can do. Okay, so. These rooms. Um, you know what? I'll just do the same thing. Like I just said, I'll... When I have more wool, I'll put, I'll get the walls done. I'll get the ceilings done. The floors done. These will just be empty rooms until I can think of a better purpose for them. And we'll do the same for the... Um, what are you doing here? We'll do the same for the... Second floor, too. I guess I could just make these rooms whatever. And I don't have enough wool. So because of that, I'm just going to say that the mansion is done for now. I'll update. I'll update this. And I'll start on another project. So finally, after such a long time of doing this world, I think it's time we update go somewhere else in the same world of course we'll go and uh, start another base and also I looked into it in uh, the secret Friday one update there's caves so we're gonna go out far enough until we can find some caves and we'll make a base so I think before I move on I'm just gonna get rid of this there we go let's just take one last look around I'm gonna show off everything I did I think just starting from the beginning here. And no, I don't care that it's nighttime. I'm not waiting. I'm not waiting for day daytime. So this is roughly where I began. This is the spawn point. Right here. We created, we created this world in October of 2022. 2023 now. That I'm recording this at least. Rainbow World. Um and this is once again I I said it before, this is InfDev. 2010 1.128 and 
this is where we started. Uh, later on, I made the stock over here and went over here. Very happy with how it turned out. Remember, we got our secret entrance over there, like under the dock. And I'm still curious when I update to the Secret Friday one, I wonder if the water's gonna be normal or not. Hmm. Anyway, if it does slow down, it'll, it'll probably stop somewhere around here, but I put up a, a blockage just in case. There's the tree, uh, tree cutting area I got over there. Entrance. Uh, bedroom. Closet. And yeah, I got... Oops. And one thing I would have liked to have done is uh, complete my diamond uh, collection here. Because we have... We did get lots of diamonds, but not enough for full suit of armor, not enough for tools. Not even enough for one more diamond block to put over here. But, oh well. And then any extra stuff was put in here. Um, well, I guess I do have some more. I guess I could use this. Okay, other than that, we have our storage room over here. Which now leads into our kitchen over here. Which leads into the dining room. And into the hallway here. We've got our bathroom. Let me fix this up a bit first. So I used all my iron blocks here. I got the bathtub. You can call that. We have the toilet and the sink. Gotta use your imagination, but that's what they are. Okay, there's our bathroom. Um, here's our. Oh, well, I guess it's pretty, still pretty incomplete with the walls and stuff. But our hallway, our throne room with the big see-through floor. You can see the lava layer there. Um, I'm curious to see if that's going to disappear when I update or not. And I hope not, but we'll see. If I get more diamonds and stuff, I'll probably decorate this a little bit more. But there's our throne. Um, and our staircase. Of course, these rooms over here are kind of there and like not, not really much to them. But there's that. And then our staircase going up here. Uh, to the second floor, and I don't really have a way to get up to the attic yet, but we'll do that later. Again, I can't I can't really do much else without enough wool, and I would say to finish this mansion, I'll probably need at least, like, maybe ten more stacks of wool, if that. And going up here, oh, going up the staircase, uh, kind of gives a nice way to get onto the roof. Which, of course, has, if I'm careful here, because there might be mobs up here. Uh, the roof here has our balcony. Once I finish the attic, I'll make a uh, a ladder or sta our staircase going up to this. And just kind of a rooftop balcony. It's kind of a nice place to just look around. Speaking of nice places to look around and look, you know, see a nice view. Our tower up here. One of my favorite features of the mansion brings it up to brings it up all the way to the build limit. As and once you get up, as long as you don't fall off it, because it is pretty uh, dangerous. There you are. And so yeah, this is a great w way to kind of. Just look at everything. In fact, I haven't come up here since I've built all this, so it's kind of cool to look down at it. And yeah, there's our world so far. And I'm thinking that once I update, which will be very soon, probably next episode, um, I'm going to... I'm going to head off in that direction. Past, it's kind of hard to see, but past the uh, monoliths over there. And uh, yeah, I'm just going to keep walking until I find some caves. Once I find caves, I'll make my base over there. We're going to have caves. We're going to have uh, mine carts. It's going to be cool. All right. Because in this particular version, uh, caves have been removed. Because I guess, I don't know, not to want to change them or something. Um, because they were removed once, implemented again before this version. 
And in this version, they are removed. And so by, well, in between this version and Secret Friday version one, uh, they are re-implemented, which means that by the next update, we'll be able to explore them. It won't just, when we go to mine, it won't just be solid rock, which will be, it'll, it'll make a lot, mining a lot more enjoyable. While we're up here, we might as well look around at the place during daytime. Yeah, I'm very happy with how this turned out. I'll have to go to that island at some point, too. Okay, let's see. I suppose we got the backyard here, which... Uh, I mean, the more I build around here, I might make this... It's kind of like... kind of doubles as like a second front yard if I make a trail here, because before I go over there, like, after I update, though, uh, I'm going to make a, a path going from here to over there, and possibly I might, maybe even later, I don't know, I'll probably make some trails going maybe in that direction too, just for the heck of it. But, uh, oh, sheep. But anyway, that's our mansion. And I'm just really happy with how this uh, overhang looks. I like how I made it. Well, so you go through here, and you get to, uh, that's how you get up here. Alright. Before I update, let's put in the windows here. I know this mansion's pretty incomplete as, as it is, but... I should at least get in the windows. Oh, I should have held on to that wool I had. Oh, well. So we'll put the wool wall on here. And let's see how that looks from the outside. And I guess I can get rid of these. I, had, I had these torches here kind of marking out where I was going to put these uh, stone paths. But they're kind of unnecessary now. Boop, 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 boop. There we go. Okay, let's look. Hey, that's not bad. I kind of like that. Hey, sheep. Perfect timing. I just needed some wool. That bro oh man, I just realized something. I'm breaking those torches. I broke my ah, my uh broke my sword by breaking those torches. That that sucks. I didn't realize that damaged it. Huh. Oh well. A new one, I guess. All right, now we got the wool. Let's see. Let's put a, a dent in this thing. Let's get our porch back if I can. There we go. Hmm. On the, the there's kind of like a space between the door here. I like to put it on the inside, uh, like so, like that. There we go. That way it's kind of more in the middle rather than. You know, having that big space after it. And oh, we got one more wool, so let's just put it, I don't know, there. There we go. Yep, got a lot. Got a long way to go. Our iron, that's fine. We'll keep that on. Oh my gosh. Okay, well, time to update. So, version, we're going from infdev 2010-06-11 to Secret Friday 1. Right, okay. And I made backups of the world. So let's see how this looks. It's the same so far. Still World 2, okay. Here we are. <laughs> okay, what's different? What's the same? Still walk like this. One of the biggest things I'm uh, curious about would be the water axe. Oh, we got flowing water. Look at that, flowing water. Nice. So that means if I break this, it should flow into place. Perfect. Very interesting. Okay. So, let's see what else is different. Signs are the same. That 
it's the same. All the textures look the same. Uh oh, 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 oh. the uh lava layer. Is that still there? It's water? That's okay, I'm gonna go look at that. That's interesting. Actually, let's just take this off. Also, wait. It wasn't like that before, was it? I can see my hand now. Okay. Okay, there's still only two perspectives. Did my hand, like, punch like that before? I'm pretty sure there was no hand. Oh, well. Okay, let's make our way down the mine here. I didn't think there'd be water, that's for sure. Oh, no, that's not water, is it? That's that's a void. That's the void. Okay. Right? Yeah. Oh, interesting. Really interesting. Okay, so that means if I break this... Let me just get some cobblestone to replace it. But if I break this... Oh, I thought I was going to crash for a second there. That is just... Okay. Just a void now. That is crazy. Well, you can tell it's getting nighttime too because this is getting kind of dark. Real interesting. Okay. And I don't suppose any caves generated here. I'm sure... I'm sure I have to go to new chunks to generate a cave. Pretty cool. So, um, like I said in the last one, I don't know if this is going to be a new episode or not, but like I said before, I'm going to make uh, kind of a trail. I'm going to head off to a new area, and we're going to make a new place, a new um, a new base, I guess. Let's see. And... I, I, I think I'm pretty much done mining in this area since there's no caves. It's kind of kind of boring mining here. So what I'll probably do in terms of getting uh, diamonds and other ores as well as um, as well as wool, I'll probably do that in another area where it's easy, or even in another update where it's easier to get that stuff. And I'll just come back here later on and finish the mansion with. Uh, with the same blocks and ores and things that I would use in this, or, or not in this version, but in uh, in the first InfDev version we did. Okay, so. Yep, yeah, pretty much everything's the same still, more or less. Oh. Oh. Uh, okay, well. Kind of a bittersweet thing here. The, I guess the, uh leaves decay now which makes cutting trees down a hell of a lot easier but on the downside of that i, I lost my uh my, my nice green uh decorative like leaves over here too that's too bad some trees here might actually look nice but i'll put a decorative, maybe a tree here and do one here okay so I'm gonna get some gravel, um, maybe some stone, cobblestone, and we'll start making a path going this way, and we're gonna go in that direction. So, I'll be back when I get that. 